Hi, and welcome to Homestead Diary. So, the plastic did good, and I can actually lift out a large amount of um, of plants with the roots intact. And yet, um, I think, of course, you know, I've been trying my best to work as quickly as possible, um, taking uh, things outside. And so I just transplanted all of the seeds of uh, carrots into the carrot uh, area. But um, I also have all these other carrots that are older. And I can actually see a couple of baby carrots. Now I don't know whether this is too late to be able to re... Um, uh, let's focus one out. Um, I don't know if this is too late to be able to transplant um, or not. But I'm going to try my best to keep it all intact in the soil uh, but yet try to separate it so we'll see how it goes but this is an example of probably um, March 27th so April May it's still uh, a little bit early so probably um, a month and a half March end of March to the end of April mid mid May so yeah like a month and a half and uh, we have just insane amount of growth. I can't even imagine how we're going to do the tomatoes. But we're going to lift them out and pray to God that we haven't messed up too bad. But see how these are turning yellow and stuff. i got to get them in the ground and um, fix them up. Hopefully it's not too late. We'll see. Little by little things are going outside. But boy, there's a lot. So... Whew. hopefully anything survives at this point I'm just like whatever we're just trying to get the all of it done at the same time so I did tons and tons of seeds and I did tons and tons of beds and I don't know what's gonna go where or what we're just winging it and establishing our first year you know so we're we're doing it though we're doing it little by little God bless you have a wonderful day